Hey, welcome to this video. Um, so today we're talking about horror. In the genre of horror, I find myself as someone who realistically is the majority, and I do get scared a lot. It's going too slow for my comfort, everybody. Uh, hello! Hi! I thought since it's spooky month, well, I might want to take the opportunity to talk about it while well, it's still October. Let's create a point. What What's my point on horror games? I think that my main point is that I find them scary, as many people probably do. I don't think this counts as a tier list, but I think we might want to have a little tier list on the side while we talk about some of our horror topics. So let's start off with Fantasy of Freddy's. In all honesty, FNAF was my first horror game, and this is probably why I am the least afraid of these animatronic peeps. In Fantasy of Freddy's, the animatronics can get kinda quirky at night, and just try to run after you, attempting to fit you inside of an animatronic suit. And in the process, you get all squishy in that in that suit, and it, it kind of hurts, so it doesn't sound so pleasant. I think it's just me, but these guys aren't too scary, and they still aren't, like, they don't look, they look mildly friendly. Also, death is 100% preventable in these situations. I'm not saving Blue from the animatronics that are keeping him captive. He's just at home. Just chillin'. And I, and I can honestly just leave the security job if I want to. So I'll put Finds of Freddy's in B tier, actually no C tier, as a good middle ground, but the Nightmare animatronics aren't cool, so you can stay in the closet. Corpse Party. If you don't know what Corpse Party is, one, good for you, and two, don't watch the anime because you will either think it's cringe or disturbing, and I don't want either of those for you. Thank you very much. In Corpse Party, simply, you perform a ritual, child to get stuck in an elementary school stuck in time. time. There are a bunch of spirits who have previously died in the school, maybe not so recent, maybe pretty recent. Regardless, they'll, they'll try to kill you because they're ghosties. Of course, the deaths are pretty nasty, and I mean... I have a pretty high pain tolerance, but I don't like getting hurt, especially if I die in this scenario. And what makes Heavenly Host Elementary School the worst is that if you die, you repeat the same death over and over again, and you're trapped there for all of eternity. eternity. And if you play the game, the way out is almost impossible to figure out. Like, you, you do some something something ritual and, and you make the little girl happy, and then have like a special piece of paper from the beginning, and also have some friends. And talk about some impossible circumstances, am I right? Of course, party goes in S tier for shoot, dude. I don't <laughs> shoot, dude. I don't want to be in the silly situation. Little nightmares. In little nightmares, you're a little person working your way to escape out of this big place with big, scary people-looking monsters. To be honest, they look a little bit silly. Not gonna lie, but I also think that being a tiny person. Constantly fleeing away from the monsters is also pretty terrifying. But at the exact same time, I think that escape in this environment isn't so dreadful and it's definitely possible. And I'll give it a B tier for, um, let's think of something on the spot. B tier for big. So just really fast, the reason why Higurashi is on this list is because I did talk about it, but I, in the editing I realized how boring it was, so I cut it out. And at the end of the video, I basically go on a little rant saying like, hey, Check out my channel because the rest of the month of October, I'm going to be playing some horror games. And then I just realized that it's already the end of October. <laughs> so, uh, I guess that means, hey, check out my channel because I guess now we're playing it some in November. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it's a bit short, but I promise after getting more experience playing more horror games and more stuff like that, I promise to continue this video in the future. So, thank you so much and I'll see you guys next time. Hi! <laughs>